All right, I'm almost done with this essay. Oh, is it time for class? Oh, okay, here comes Dennis. Hmm. Okay, I wonder what we're gonna be doing today in class. I can't even hear Miss Jendrick. The algorithm is, uh, oh my goodness. I literally can't even hear her. Oh my goodness, seriously, this kid? Ugh, this class is so noisy. Okay, Natalie, relax, just focus. Yeah, not happening. If your class is awfully loud, then you gotta get yourself some noise-canceling headphones. Yep, they're probably the best thing you need this school year to allow you to just focus on your work in a loud environment. Now, keeping these by your side not only drowns everyone out, but also gives everyone the silent message that you'd rather not be disturbed unless absolutely necessary. Okay, how is it that you spell absence? Is it C or is it S? If you're struggling with not knowing how to spell a certain word for emails or schoolwork, don't just rely on the computer software to detect whether or not it's right, because trust me, in the end, you'll have no one to blame but yourself. Well, the app called Grammarly. It's incredible for detecting words and even explaining to you why it's right and wrong. Oops, I missed a comma, a dot. I could use this word instead. Oh wow, this looks amazing and sounds way smarter. Wow, I can't believe how early I arrived today. What do I do? What to do? What to do? Hmm, maybe I should get a hand on some emails? Wow, but it's so early. Not sure people will appreciate getting woken up by my email notification. Mm, but I gotta send those emails. If you find yourself being on the opposite time zone as someone else, but you don't want to forget or be drowned out by their load of emails, a great solution to this is to use the app Boomerang. So this app is amazing. I literally can't rave enough about it. It allows you to schedule your emails for later in the day. So pretty much you can sit down in one day and write all your emails and not be so overwhelmed with constantly being online to answer them. All right, time for some dictionary work. Ugh, so excited. Miss Jendrick says today's lit ugh. homework assignment is to take notes on pages one through 45. Is she kidding me? My Felicia, oh my God. Okay, so instead of using your precious time and risk energy to write up all of your schoolwork, I have a practical productivity hack for you. Yeah, don't let this be you. Instead, use this app called Speech Notes. Now, I wish I had known about this, but I was still in school. Pretty much, it writes what you say. Yep, it's like your personal assistant. Chapter one, understanding attributes. Attributes gives you a way to specify additional information about an element. You can now practice your writing by not only reading it, but it'll also be simultaneously writing it for you, the perfect way for you to review condensed notes later on when studying for an exam. Sit next to someone who is being productive so that that energy can rub off on you. Seeing someone work hard will not only inspire you, but it'll also push you to elevate yourselves, and who doesn't want to be around people who are constantly challenging their minds to improve? I recently came across this technique called calendar blocking, which literally allows you to make time for everything you want to do and assist you in time management and organization. Getting a to-do list, which can be super overwhelming and you don't even know where to start, start by blocking out times in your day. So for instance, schedule in the task and exactly how long you predict it to take. You can color code it so your calendar will be a little bit easier on the eyes by work, personal, health, meetings, etc. It allowed me to not only be more efficient and productive, but I can also see which tasks will take the longest, so I'll tackle those first thing in the morning. Now, if managing time is not your forte, no worries, here's a simple hack to be sure that you get all your schoolwork done. I, instead of going by the actual assignment due date, which let's be honest, usually gives us room for procrastination and not taking it too seriously until the due date rolls around. So what I do instead is I give myself a fake deadline, usually a few days before the real one. So not only does this give you extra time to go over everything, but it's guaranteed that you'll be submitting your best work possible instead of squeezing it in to the last minute. Ooh, all right, time for bed. All right, all I gotta do is just close these curtains and cozy on up. If you already struggle with sleep, not to worry. I've done plenty of sleep hack videos in the past that I'll link down below for you. And trust me, if you also struggle with waking up, I have a full playlist for you to check out below. When the alarm goes on, it's just a bright blue light shining in your face. You'll probably feel exhausted and it's just not the most natural way to wake up. So here's this little life hack for you. Instead, open up the window blinds. This allows for you to sleep with the beautiful night sky. It's soothing, relaxing, and slowly as the day becomes brighter, you naturally begin to wake up. Doing this makes me start my day even earlier and be more productive because I'm literally rising when the sun does.
low decision fatigue. What this is is our ability to make good decisions throughout the day usually decrease because of the more decisions we make, the more fatigued and irritated we become. That's why productive people like Steve Jobs and Mark Zuckerberg often opted for wearing the same outfit every day. So what you got to do is actually start categorizing your outfits by occasion. That way it's easier for you to pick out an outfit and when there's a special event or something is a little more casual or hey you're just feeling lazy you'll find the simple trick will help you in feeling more organized and energized. Sitting all day can be a drag. Trust me, it can hurt your back, your neck, and quite frankly, your entire mood. So get comfortable and invest in a stand-up desk. It's actually known that stand-up desks do more than just reducing your back pain. Help your body be less stressed because when you're comfortable, you're more likely to put forth your best efforts. <laughs> oh, wow. Where's everyone? Wow. Okay, what time is it? 8 a.m.? Holy cow, I'm here early. Okay, if you arrive to class earlier than everyone else, take this time to not just sit around or stare at your phone screen. You'll notice this extra time throughout the day to spend time getting ahead on homework, projects, emails, add up greatly throughout the day. Instead of waiting to finish your homework after school, why not get ahead on it at school? That way class will start, you're ahead on lectures, ahead in the class, and hey, you have an extra hour in the afternoon to take it off. Wait, before you go, be sure that you check out this video right now because I'm currently doing a massive back to school giveaway with the coolest, the newest, and literally the most amazing school supplies ever. It is so simple to enter. Check out that video for full details. All you have to do is be a part of the family by hitting that subscribe button and be sure to ring that bell because I do deliver a full pizza to your door, but I can't ring your bell unless you ring my bell. You don't want to miss out on that pizza, right? So be sure to ring that bell. Secondly, all you have to do is go over to this picture right over here on my Instagram and comment what grade you're going into and what your dream job is. That is it. You can go on this picture and comment as many times as you want. I'm going to be picking from the comments six lucky subscribers. We'll be announcing the six lucky winners over here on this channel on this date. So make sure that you're attentive to that. I want to wish you guys an amazing day. I wanted to do this giveaway just to give back to you guys for all the love, all the support. And I hope that you guys get excited for back to school. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to live weird or die normal. Bye.